Crosby Beach is situated near the mouth of the River Mersey, a few miles north of Liverpool. On the beach, there is an installation by the artist Anthony Gormley of 100 iron statues. Some of the statues are covered by the tide twice a day. The level of the sea varies continuously. Every few seconds it changes because of small waves. On a windy day the waves are bigger and the water level changes more, but still on timescales of seconds. Each figure is 189 centimetres tall. A camera with a zoom lens was placed on some rocks and every minute a photograph was taken of one of the statues. The photos were then put together to create a stop-motion animation of the tide changing the sea level around the figure. Tidal motion is caused by the gravitational effects of the moon and sun combined with the rotation of the earth. The tides at Liverpool are particularly large, reaching around 9 metres. Although the tide takes many hours to ebb and flow, the tide is just another wave that changes the sea level continuously. The tide progresses around the UK. As shown in this footage from a 1960s BBC TV programme, there is particularly high variability in the Severn and the Mersey estuaries. Sea level changes for different reasons over a range of timescales, including years to decades. This animation shows how warming and cooling alters the height of the North Atlantic, changing each year from 1950 to 2010. Warmer waters, leading to expansion and higher sea level, are marked as red. Cooler waters, leading to lower sea level, are marked as blue. Sea level changes continuously on timescales that humans naturally perceive, but also over many decades and centuries. Sea level is varying from climate change. There is the local rising or falling of sea level linked to regions of warming or cooling, as well as a global rise in sea level from more water being added to the oceans from melting of ice on land.